Hi, this is Emma Wright with your authorbusiness.com. Today I'm going to show you how you can change your DNS or the name servers that um, you have, which you get from your hosting company um, and change it on your domain name providers uh, website so that it'll point your domain name will point to the hosting company that you are attached to. And I've used several hosting companies. One of them is GoDaddy and the other three I've used are HostGator, Bluehost and SiteGround. I actually moved over from HostGator to SiteGround and also Bluehost because I don't really like HostGator. I mean, it's a matter of preference. I've heard that WP Engine is really fast, but that is if you're further along and you want to um, get a really fast website, but it's quite costly, which is why I chose SiteGround and Bluehost for my different domain names. And so I've bought several of my domain names from Internet BS, and I've also bought my domain names from GoDaddy. I prefer Internet BS because they're pretty reasonable, less than $10 for the entire year, and you don't have to pay for the private who is. So this is how you go about changing the DNS. So once you get onto the D Internet BS page and you click my account and you will see that it'll bring you a drop down menu and you can choose my domain and it'll bring you next to this page, which will show you all the different domains, uh, domain names that you've bought. In this instance, I'm going to show you how I'm going to change my yourbookbusiness.com DNS. So. Once you hit the your book business DNS, I'll bring you to this page, which is um, the dashboard whereby you can do this. So the next thing you need to do is you need to update your DNS list. Once you hit the update DNS list, it'll bring you to this page. Um, I used to have HostGator, like I said, but I need to change it to Bluehost. Now you don't have to worry about the IP because you don't really need it. You just need to change the name servers. So how do you find the name servers? Well, depending on which hosting company that you use, you can do a few things. Some of them will email you the name servers uh, information. Some some with some of them you can just call them and they'll give it to you. And another easy way is to actually do a Google search, which is what I did. I did a Google search for Bluehost and it gave me the name server information for Bluehost, ns1.bluehost.com and ns2.bluehost.com. You just need the NS information for each of them. You don't need the IP. Once you have the name server information, be sure to place them in these spaces, number one and number two. Some of them may only just have one name server information. Regardless, Joe, you don't have to do anything to the IP address here. You just need the name service information. And then be sure to click on save. And you have to give Internet BS about two to um, three days, 24 to 48 hours, maybe sometimes even uh, up to 72 hours um, to point your domain name to the host hosting companies that you're with. So that's it for today on how to update or include your DNS on Internet BS. Should you buy your domain name from them? If you need any more information on how to set up your website or anything related to having an online author business, please sign up for my emails on my webpage, which is yourauthorbusiness.com. My free email tutorials will walk you through the process and also be sure to subscribe to my channel to get updates on new tutorials I'll be posting. Be sure to post your comments and questions below so I can see what your needs are and as an author and as an online business person so that I can answer your questions and, and make new tutorials for you. All for now, until next time, this is Emma Wright at yourauthorbusiness.com. Bye-bye.